Hey there, here's how to count. One, two, three, four. What we're gonna do, bass drum on one and three, left hand snare on two and four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So this is the big part of practice right here, getting your right foot and your left hand to be solid. And this is obviously at a certain speed. It's a good speed. It can be practiced slower and eventually we'll get faster. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now while this is happening, the overall goal is to use one of our rhythm symbols. And these are, when I'm counting to four, these are quarter notes. And we want to be able to take our right hand and do the four quarter notes at the same time. One, two, three, four. Pretty gentle. You don't have to hit it really hard, but just one, two, three, four. And as you're doing this, you want to think about where that bass drum goes and where that snare goes. So if you remember earlier, I was saying put the bass drum on one and three. So what you do, you take your sprite hand, play at a nice moderate tempo so you can think about this and aim because what we're going to do I'm going to count two three four one two three four now you're going to pay attention to where one and three are at and that's where we're going to apply our bass drum so watch this one two three four one two three four so this is how we build it Okay? And you think about where that snare is going. The snare goes on two and four. So you'll have your bass drum and your snare acting together. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now, your right hand and both, your right hand and left hand are steady and your right foot is playing the one and three these are your down beats so down beats is also going to be the same thing as the quarter notes those are interchangeable phrases right there and just simple one two three four and the counting is very important because you want to be able to pay attention to where that one is one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, four. One, two, three, four. And you think about where the two is. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And now you think about where the three is. One, two, three, four. Mm, mm, three, mm, right? Now, how about the four? One, two, three, four. That one feels pretty good. But anyway, anyways, learning how to count is very important because you think about where your hands are supposed to go and your teacher will ask you, where is the one? You gotta know, one, two, three, four.